It's been a dry, hot summer for much of the United States, and the heat wave has caused some major problems for farmers. But local growers here in Rhode Island tell Eyewitness News that this growing season has been successful. Eyewitness News Green Team reporter Pete Mangione has more details new at 530. Prolonged drought in portions of the Midwest has hit farmers hard this summer. Eyewitness News wanted to find out if local farmers had been encountering any weather issues of their own. Plump blueberries are usually a sign of a good summer, and local grower Scott Millar feels very fortunate for the good weather. We've had plenty of moisture, especially through June, uh, earlier in the season, so uh, the water isn't really a problem at all for us. Here at the Goddard Park Work Farmer's Market, other growers seem to agree. Local farmer Rebecca McCusker says the wet June may have delayed things a little bit, but overall she says her plants and produce have had no problems taking root. Growth season's been going great. Um, a little late this year because of the weather, but everything's been growing really well. Um, blueberries are amazing. But the growers know that they are at the mercy of Mother Nature, and their sympathies go out to the farmers in drought-stricken states like Texas and Oklahoma. It's terrible, especially if you have too much water or not enough. It, it, it becomes very difficult to manage that. But with favorable weather so far in southern New England, the farmers markets are a busy place. These customers love supporting their local farmers, and a trip to buy fresh fruits and veggies is an important part of their day. It's a very social, um, and I love the produce and the plants, everything. Goddard Park is one of nine farmers market locations operated by the DEM. Last week they opened a new market at State Pier 9 in Newport. For the Green Team, I'm Pete Mangione. Eyewitness News.